Otaku Vietnam. What does the O stand for? Oh my god, I need some Pocky. Okay, we're going to be playing this game, uh, Go Go Nippon, my first trip to Japan, version 2015. Um, personal experience with this game, I love it, and it's awful. It's just horrible. It's it's the most self-indulgent shit you'll ever play, and it's absolutely adorable and kind of fucked up. So we're going to be playing this incredible, lovable, horrible thing. Uh, okay, so we're going to start with the name Weeb Trash. Now, this is important because if you are playing this game or watching this video, you are likely Weeb Trash. Including me. I'm Weeb Trash. I'm okay with this fact, but I mean, you know, still a little sad. But anyway, let's get started with our character, Weeb Trash. And uh, we're just going to keep this default because I remember last time I played through this game, um, it basically resulted in like me being like $99,999 in debt. So I didn't really get any kind of, you know, uh, like, uh, frame of mind for how much a trip to Japan would actually cost, which is the whole point of this. You know, we're supposed to feel like we're actually going on a trip to Japan with anime girls and way too much trivia. So yeah, let's just keep this to default. <sighs> I shouldn't have flown Delta. It's no use. I'll never get my luggage back. My dream is finally coming true. I'd planned to sleep on the plane so I'd have plenty of energy, but I just couldn't help but masturbate in the bathroom. Why did I have to masturbate in the bathroom? I haven't felt tired this whole time. Only now. <sighs> There's four W's, I think, so I, I had to extend that quite a bit. It, it's just what I do. I suddenly feel really exhausted. Ugh, God. I just want to sleep, but I can't. And my life is terrible. Ugh. But we are finally beginning our descent. We ask you to fasten your seatbelts at this time. Also, by the way, have you heard the one about the airport and the buildings? It's pretty funny. It's a, no, no, Dave, don't. <laughs> I can't go to sleep now because I'm finally uh wait for it I'm finally realizing my dream of coming to Japan you know some people dream of like being astronauts or the president or something this guy dreams of going to weed paradise dot 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 this is that landmass below us must be Japan. Wouldn't it be great if the plane was hijacked or something and the landmass below them was like Cuba? I, 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 because, I mean, he's been dazed out the whole time on the plane. Maybe he just didn't notice. Who knows? Wow. This is incredible. I've been saving up my money and diligently studying Japanese all in preparation for this day. You know, you don't have to study Japanese to go to Japan. You can just learn a few words and it'll pretty much be good so long as you stick with a tour guide. But this guy's cheap and he's... I'll, you'll find out. My beloved Japan, even though I've never been. I swear to make the most of my time here. But there's something I have to do first. I'm gonna be in Japan for a week. And while I'm here, I'll be staying at the home of a Japanese family. This sounds like a bad idea. Oh, this sounds like a really bad idea. I'll be staying with two brothers I met in an online chat room, Makoto and Akira. They were thrilled to hear that I was finally coming to Japan and invited me to stay at their home while I was here. One of them looks like Jojo and one of them looks like, of them looks like that guy from Paranoia Agents. Really weird. So now I have to meet up with the two of them. But where the heck are they? Who says heck? Especially when they're thinking to themselves, like, swear, come on. This game is cheesecake factory cheesecake levels. So, you know, if you're going to have swearing, just have them swear. For fuck's sake. I told them when my plane was coming in. I figured they'd be here by now to meet me. Dot, 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 dot. Hmm, I don't see them in the crowd anywhere. And I don't see anyone who could possibly be them. What am I going to do? Well, it helps that the airport is completely empty. If This is creepy. This is like shit out of um the Langoliers. <laughs> because, you know, I, I totally remember the Langoliers with the demonic 
Pac-Man CGI things eating time or something. That that short was or not short. It was like a mini series. That mini series was weird. Uh, huh? Hmm, excuse me. Sorry to bother you, but are you you trash? Well, I wouldn't be playing this if I wasn't, honey. Um, yes, my name is Weep Trash, but... Then it is you, thank goodness. For a minute there, I thought we'd gone to the wrong gate. Um, but who are you? Oh my, I'm sorry. I forgot to introduce myself. I'm Batman. I'm Makoto. Misaki Makoto. It's nice to meet you, if that's the right thing to say. No. You should have said, do me like a rotisserie chicken, but, I, you know, semantics. What? Makoto? You mean, you're... And this is... Oh, come on, don't be shy. You have to introduce yourself. You know, I just realized my, my voice for Makoto sounds very much like a very fey gay man. And there's absolutely nothing wrong with that, because that's basically what Makoto is. Uh... <laughs> nice to meet you. My name is Akira Mizaki. I hate Akira. <laughs> She's awful. They're both awful. But Akira's like some level of just horrible tsundere shit. I love it. Um, If that girl is Makoto, then this must be Akira? What the hell? Oh, now you're saying hell. Fuck off. And, and I'm looking forward to, to seeing you. <laughs> dot, 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 dot. Hmm? What's wrong, Weep Trash? Uh, well, uh, Makoto and Akira, I thought you would be guys. Uh, Did her boobs just jiggle? That, that's that's great. This, this game, 10 out of 10, masterpiece. It's like Skyrim, but with anime boobs. <laughs> Aren't Makoto and Akira boys' names in Japan? It's always been that way in the manga I read and the anime I watched, so I just, you know, maybe step one to making a good impression of yourself is don't bring up manga and anime with people you just met, even if they are Japanese. Because you know what? Most Japanese people think that shit's kind of weird too. So, yeah, maybe just control yourself in that regard. Just saying, it's not something you should bring up as like a first meeting thing. It never is. That's true. Now that you mention it, we never actually told you in the chat. You can't necessarily tell gender through Japanese text like you can in English. I have no idea whether that's true or not. I'm guessing it is. They all just kind of look like scribbles to me. I'm sure it's a be it's a beautiful language, it, it, undoubtedly. Like, all languages are beautiful, except for English, which is kind of just, like, a three-way car pile-up of a language. Most languages are actually, like, coherent, so, you know, it's a beautiful language, but the language just looks like scribbles to me. Dot, 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 dot. It's true that Makoto and Akira are often boys' names in Japan, so it sometimes often results in misunderstandings. But it's not so unusual for them to be girls' names, like, well, with us. Da, 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 da. It really surprised you, didn't it? I, I guess. I think it's a little more surprising that you're anime girls. I mean, if this is ostensibly supposed to take place in some kind of real life, you being anime girls is just weird. Also, if we go to Japan and they turn out to be anime girls, does that mean that the guy we're playing as is an American cartoon? Is he like um, Dipper from, from uh, Gravity Falls or something? Maybe he's Steven Universe. I don't know. Actually, that's not too unlikely, considering the, the creator of Steven Universe is, like, obsessed with this shit. So, you know. I mean, it's it's a really good show. It's just... Um, yeah, it, it's very... It wears its inspirations on its sleeve, let's say. Anyway. Um, yeah. I see. Then Makoto and Akira were both girls could have sworn they were boys. Huh? Wait a minute. If they're both girls, does that mean I just stumbled into a week's stay in a house with two girls? What? Dot, 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 dot. I totally did. And now that I look at them, they're both super cute. This might be my lucky day. Now that the misunderstanding is cleared up, let's try this again. 
My name is Masaki Makoto. I'm studying English literature at a university in the city. I look forward to getting to know you, getting to love you. Do -do 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 -do. I'm Weeb Trash. Yes, you are. <laughs> I know that much. I can tell by your outfit. You're dressed like Ash from Pokemon. It's really weird. Ah, that's right. I look forward to getting to know you too. I forget what that's from. I don't know. I'm blanking on it. Yes, indeed. And this is my little sister, Akira. Hey, Aki-chan. Uh, nice to meet you. Um, nice to meet you too. <laughs> uh, well, what the? She seemed so happy just a minute ago. So happy. Why is she giving me the cold shoulder now? But what is it, Aki-chan? Why are you so angry? I'm, I'm not angry at all. Oh, don't say that. Are you still mad that he thought you were a guy? Well, you know, considering the rise of man buns, really shouldn't be going with that hairstyle there, Aki-chan. You, you, you can't pull it off. Just saying. No, 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 I understand I wasn't mad. Come on, you were so looking forward to seeing him. Why? <laughs> I was not, I wasn't looking forward to it at all. Hee <laughs> hee, you're not being honest. Um... Uh, I'm sorry, it looks like Aki-chan is in a bit of a mood. This kind of happens, you know, when she doesn't get ice cream. Don't take it personally. We just need to get her some ice cream. It, how much does ice cream cost in Japan? I'm curious. Probably not. Probably. Mm. Well, how many cows do they have? I don't think they eat that much beef. I don't know. This is just what I think about when I play these kinds of games. Ah, uh, but she looks like she's mad at me. She's not. She's really not. It's just. Just what? She, she's just at that age. Please don't worry about it, alright? Yeah, underage. Uh, okay. <laughs> well, anyway, now that the introductions are finished, we'd better get going. I'd like to get you home as soon as possible. Oh, I bet you would. But first, I have a favor to ask. What is it? Well, you can speak Japanese, right? Yeah, I've been studying it back home. Good. Then from now on, I'd like you to speak in Japanese as much as possible, okay? To tell you the truth, Aki-chan's English is a little bad. Little? Nice to meet you. I see. Yes. <laughs> Indeed. Indubitably. Wonderful. Spectacular. Assured. I had a feeling, judging by her pronunciation earlier. God, this guy's so racist. I don't even know why. He just is. That's how I imagine she does silence. She's just like... Hmm? What? what? But she didn't speak. Didn't she speak English in that chat room? I translated all of that for her. Okay. So what you're saying is that she wrote in chat messages on her own, and then you just came into her room and translated them for her, or were you writing on the same computer? I don't get this. And also, you were just talking with this one guy. Also, I can understand maybe like one in a family being a chat room person, but both? This is weird. Ah, that explains it. <laughs> sure it does, kid. Anyway, may we switch to Japanese from here on out? Sure, I understand. Then let's start again. Oh wait, oh shit. Uh, then let's start again. Makoto, Akira, I look forward to getting to know you. <clears throat> Hehe, <laughs> nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Now then, let's get going. Okay.